In this video, we will demonstrate how to use the GTEx Portal's Gene EQTL Visualizer to view the CIS EQTLs for a gene of interest. On the home page, we will enter a gene symbol in this entry field and press return. This will open the Gene EQTL Visualizer. It has one row per tissue and one column per variant. The variants are sorted by genomic location. Each data point represents a CIS-EQTL, an association between the selected gene, a tissue, and a variant. We can use the tissue menu to select which tissues we want to display. We will select esophagus muscularis, muscle skeletal, and testis. The Gene EQTL Visualizer uses color to represent effect size. Dark blue represents strong negative effect size. Dark red represents strong positive effect size. The size of the circle is proportional to minus log p-value. Therefore, large dark circles may be of interest as they represent cis-CQTLs with strong effect size and a small p-value. We show an overview of the cis-CQTLs above the bubble heat map because there are more EQTLs that we can display on the screen at one time. The dark gray rectangle represents the viewport that is currently being displayed. Looking at the summary view, we can see an area of interest in this location. We can grab and slide the viewport toward that location. In the bubble heat map, this arrow shows the transcription start site for the selected gene, and this marker shows the transcription end site. The gray squares below the heat map show additional information about the variant in that column. Squares that are outlined in blue represent variants that are in an exon region. Looking at this location, we can see a number of cis-CQTLs in the tissue muscle skeletal. Below the heat map, we display linkage disequilibrium data. Using this LD display, we can see that these EQTLs are in high LD with each other, suggesting that these EQTLs may not be independent signals. Above the heat map, we can use sliders to filter out EQTLs by effect size and by p-value. Clicking on an EQTL opens up the EQTL box plot, which shows more information about that EQTL. Clicking on the X closes the EQTL box plot. 